Hey guys, Half Chrome. Today we've got another selfie drone. It's the JJRC H49 Soul. Well, that one's a little different than these other guys I've got here, as you'll see. Uh, let's take a look inside the box. First, there it is. Look at that. It's tiny. It is a little drone. And you'll see the uh, remote transmitter that comes with it, also pretty little. For reference, I got my cell phone here. You can see this is an iPhone 7 Plus. That's a small little drone. Right? I also like how it unfolds the props with a push of a button. The motors and the propellers, you don't have to deal with folding them really. You just push a button and boom, there you go, ready to fly. You can see we've got a camera here. It is a 720p, two megapixel HD camera, which is better than both of these drones here and on par with this e-sheen, right? These other selfie drones you'll see, I have to pull the arms out, they gotta snap in place. Size difference for sure. Now, this JJRC is one of the hot new up and coming models, but this JJRC, the Elfie, is kind of the original inexpensive selfie drone. Okay, so let's talk about how these two things compare. Uh, this one, obviously a lot bigger. Um, camera actually a lot worse this uh, old Elfie drone only has a 480p camera where this one is a 720p camera you get some uh, HD video this one here has a really nice altitude hold as does this one so they have kind of the same uh, feature sets uh, but this little one gosh it is so small I really really am impressed by the engineering on this guy you just fold it up throw it in your pocket and you go fly. So let's do that. Let's take these things for a spin. All right, I'll tell you a little bit more about the JJRC H49 Soul. Why? Well, because it's better, right? Spoiler alert, this is the better drone. It's smaller, it's a little bit quicker, it takes better pictures. Maybe it's not quite as stable, but that's because it is smaller. Um, fun to fly. Uh, I really like the tiny little remote, but you can also fly it with your phone, which is an added bonus. Altitude hold works pretty well. Headless mode works. Uh, don't bother with return home. One key takeoff. Nice little addition. Um, and you can see it's it's fairly maneuverable for a tiny little guy. Right? You don't want to get this thing outside in the wind. It is best suited for indoor flight. Let's take a look at the camera on it. Like I said, 720p HD quality. No stabilization. So as you move the drone, it moves. Um, taking pictures. This is a standard picture. It has something called beauty mode. See it flicker a little bit. Changed. Um, like I said, best indoors, fun to fly inside, great little selfie drone. Pick one of these guys up, it's under 50 bucks, it's a great investment. Just the engineering on it, fantastic. Okay, so what about the Elfie? Well, the Elfie is nice and stable, so it's got that going for it. It's not very fast. It does do push button flips, which is kind of fun, but uh, you have to use a tablet or smartphone in order to fly it. I'm not really a big fan of that. I'm sure, it works well. Uh, you get that PV feed right on your screen there. Uh, but really, this thing is built for taking photos, so uh, let's take a look. Here's some selfies we took with the Elfie. Right, it's fun for that, but the uh, non HD camera is kind of a damper. Both of these drones, pretty fun, but again, we're gonna recommend the smaller JJRC H49 Soul. It's a fantastic little drone. You can fold it up, throw it in your pocket, and go. Now, if you're really looking for something awesome, take a look at the DJI Spark. There it is in red. It is a fantastic drone, right? Full HD, video stabilization, it's got a gimbal. Hey, you can learn about that more at halfchrome.com. Check us out, and please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.